Payatas is a world heritage site on its own right. Payatas is not monolithic. It's subculture after subculture after subculture, and everything that you see is a cultural expression. Aside from outstanding universal value, authenticity, integrity, and management protective systems, at the end of the line for every World Heritage Site, the higher value that it serves is peace. Peace. If we decide to inscribe Payatas, are we serving the sphere of peace? Is the message here peace, acceptance, understanding the ethnicity of Payatas? So in other words, if you've been to Payatas, it is as if you've been to all of the, <laughs> practically all of the provinces of the Philippines because uh, every ethnic uh, community in the Philippines is uh, represented. Ethno-linguistic uh, uh, group in the Philippines is represented in Payatas. So it gave rise to that subculture because I think the system that you're describing is uh, non-existent in the mainstream economy. It's only in Payatas. Why not? Because if we're talking of Mount Hamigitan being a world heritage site because there's a different kind of biodiversity there, then there's a different kind of diversity within Payatas itself. Ah, I never had that idea before, but I'm trying to like it, yeah.